create a rain effect using Nuke's particle system. First, add a card, adjust the scale, rotate it 90 degrees on the x-axis. This card will serve as the emitter for our particles. Next, connect a particle emitter node, set the following values inside the properties. This creates small uniform particles that fall like raindrops. Now add a particle directional force node to simulate gravity. Set the strength to minus 0.05 along the y-axis to pull the particles downwards. To make the rain look more natural, use a particle turbulence node with strength set to 0.05 on the z-axis. This adds some randomness to the movement. For realistic interactions with the ground, add a particle bounce node and set the following values. External bounce mode, bounce 0, friction 1. Internal bounce mode bounds 0.01 friction 1. Make sure to choose object as input. To create a varied surface, use a displaced geo node with a random noise pattern. Set the scale to 10 for displacement effect on the ground. Connect a camera and a scene into the scanline render node. Finally, add a vector generator and vector blur for smooth motion blur effects on the raindrops. And that's how you.